it's called. Hey everyone, welcome back to the woodshop. Thanks for joining me on another project. Now, today's project, this is a special one, uh, so I've got to try and be a bit careful because I don't want to give the game away, but a friend of mine has uh, just been promoted, um, so congratulations. I don't want to say their name, very careful not to give away uh, whether it's a he or a she, but their partner got hold of me and asked if I could do something for their promotion. I was really honoured to be able to uh, do something for them, so what I thought I was going to do was... Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, basically, I'm gonna turn a bowl, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna install somehow the berry badge of the promotion that they've just picked up. I went to stores while I was at work the other week and uh, picked up the berry badge. There it is. Don't worry, Your Majesty. I did pay for it. Now the first thing we've got to do is choose a decent bit of wood. Okay, so we've got to find a bit of wood. Uh, so if we have a look around the wood shop. We've got quite a decent stock. Uh, we've got some ash. Uh, these are chestnut, some elm, plenty of cherry, sycamore, some cedar. Uh, those are beech, and in the corner are yew. And then on the other side of the shop, behind these boxes here, we've got a nice big pile of beech with a huge beech piece there. And then all of that collection there are uh, is oak, different types of oak. Okay, so I really want to pick something quite dark because uh, obviously this is bright and I really want the contrast to be nice against the, against the brightness of this. So what I'm going to go for is I'm going to go for a little piece of cherry. Now the partner who got hold of me did say that they wanted it for uh, like their desk at work. So it doesn't, I don't want it to be too big because it's obviously the you know, space is a premium. Uh, right, so I've got my piece, I've got my bit of wood. Let's get turning. <laughs>
Okay, so we've got it reversed in the chuck now. Uh, so we can start working on the face and hollowing this out ready for the uh, badge to be set inside. So we get this spinning, get this centre section out and then uh, hopefully get it finished and we can get the berry badge laid into it today. Okay, so that's been sanded within an inch of its life now that's gone right up to 800 and it's smooth as silk uh, so I'm just gonna go through the same process as last time I'm gonna throw some sand and sealer on here followed up by some Yorkshire grit and then finished off with at least two coats of the wood wax 22 uh, so I'll come back to you when this is all buffed up and ready to go <laughs> Okay, so it's time to mix up some resin uh, so we've got the scales and something to mix it in and a stirrer uh, right the resin I use is the resin from resinforart.com the link will be in the description uh, but this here is part A so it's two parts of this to one part of part B workshop but I've had a ton of requests coming in just before Christmas uh, which is great so loads of people are getting loads of uh, individual one-of-a-kind stuff so the bowl is finished and there it is uh, it looks absolutely spectacular I hope you can see that in the light uh, the badge has come out really well okay so this started off as a slab of cherry uh, with a uh, Chief's berry badge in the middle of it and then in the back just inside the recess I don't know if you can see that but I've just put three very very slight rings in there one for the person who requested it one for the person that it's for and one for their uh, for their little one so this is going to get wrapped up and posted out ASAP so they get it well in time for Christmas all right so you know who I'm talking to out there if you ordered this I hope you enjoy it um, fingers crossed that your other half enjoys it as well and congratulations on the promotion as ever, if you've enjoyed what I've done, 
Uh, please hit the like button down below, that would be really appreciated. Uh, also head over and hit the subscribe tab, um, be a part of the channel and get notified every time there's a new video. And if you've got anything to comment or you've got any suggestions then please hit me in the comment section below. Please feel free to share the video, share it out to your friends and family. Fingers crossed they like what I'm doing. And head over to my Facebook page, the link for that's in the description. As always, all the tools, all the finishes and all the products that I use are in the description, so have a read of those. But for now, that's all from me, so I'll see you next time. Cheers.